So I'm going to also start on some burgers here. And what we're going to do with the burgers is we're going to top it off with Koopa cheese. Mm, nice. Bacon and a fried egg. This is a low calorie meal it's today. It's totally low calorie. <laughs> And this meat, you said, comes from a local farmer as this well, this ground meat? This is from one of the owners of the restaurant. He has a cattle company called uh, Cathead Ranch, okay. which is in Savingsville, Pennsylvania, mm -hmm. which is right down the street from the restaurant. So it doesn't really get much fresher or more local than this? No. And he raises, like, one, we get one to two cows. We go through a lot of ground meat. Yeah, I would say. So. Wow. Is this going to be one burger? Yeah. Ooh. We use a 10-ounce burger at the restaurant. Mm -hmm. You can tell this meat is different from what you would get at the grocery store. It's so much darker and more Well, red. it's just not byproducts. Yeah. After they take off the sirloins and the tenderloins and whatnot, everything's in here. Right. So we're going to season it again with the uh, nice the spice. So at the restaurant, I even do this with the burgers. Instead of putting it on a char grill, mm -hmm. I'll saute it <coughs> and then throw it in the oven. Okay. Really lets you get a nice crust on the outside that yeah, way. Yeah, I love it. And I mean, this is a big burger. This is like a burger for three people. <laughs> <laughs> so I imagine your portion sizes are pretty generous over there. Everything is big. <laughs> yes. Oh, wow. Look at that. And how do you usually cook the burgers? Is it depending on how the people same, want them? Or? The same way. I do it in a pan and then yeah. finish it in the oven. Do you keep them sort of pink in the middle? Yeah. Yeah. When you have really nice fresh meat like that, I think it's sacrilegious to have it well done. Absolutely. <laughs> All right, John, now what did I miss while I was chatting away? Okay, we are uh, we have the egg starter for the burger. Look at that egg. Oh, Now, do you get this also from a local farmer? Uh, we occasionally do, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a big egg, too. Is that like a jumbo? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm going to add the Cooper cheese to it. Now, this is like a sharp American cheese, Yeah. right? which is awesome on a burger. So nice and creamy. Love it. Okay, give that a melt. It's our 10 ounce Cathead Ranch burger. Wow, and I love how you're serving it on a what looks to me like a po' boy roll. <laughs> yeah, it's very similar <laughs> to it. Yeah. yeah. So we're gonna add our smoked bacon. My gosh. No lettuce and tomato on this burger, huh? No. Just, this is a meat lover's burger. Oh it's a little God. over the top, but. But that's just how you do it. That's how I roll. Yeah. And then we're gonna top it off with a fried egg. Mm, it's nice and crispy on the edges. I love that. Runny and the yolk. egg yolk actually has, acts as a sauce. Nice. Wow. This looks incredible. And that's our burger.